There is a set of funding and targeted supports that TEA, the Texas Education Agency, has developed and designed to help accelerate student learning. It's called the Texas COVID Learning Acceleration Supports, or T-Class. As its name suggests, TEA created these in the wake of COVID and made these state and federal funds available to local education agencies. For districts, TEA provides 10 of what they call decision points within T-Class. In this video, we'll focus on Huntsville ISD's utilization of the grant Decision 5, which is classified as a residency program support. This grant required that Huntsville ISD implement a paid teacher residency in partnership with a high quality educator preparation program and implement innovative staffing models to sustainably fund teacher residency and build educator pipelines. Once established, we were able to access funding to pay for these student teacher residents and award a mentor teacher stipend. We're proud of our continuing close working relationship with both the College of Education at Sam Houston State and the ESC6. And we're grateful for their partnership in the effort to bring the T-Class 5 to fruition here in Huntsville ISD. So now that you know what T-Class 5 means, let's hear from some of the participants here in Huntsville ISD. My name's Ariana Ramp. Okay, my name's Riley Dorr. I just graduated from Sam Houston State University. Yes, so I was here for a full year before officially being hired. I teach uh, special education in a total learning classroom or TLC. Well, technically I was hired on before, but officially as a teacher that's certified to teach by myself. So something great about Sam Houston is they put you in the classroom very early on. So we had field one, which is one day out of the week, field two, which is two days out of the week, and then you st start your year-long residency, which is three days and then the full five days. They said, hey, we have this brand new program. Um, there's a potential that you could actually be paid to be a student teacher this year. And I thought that was amazing. We had to fill out lots of forms. We had to do um, kind of like a Zoom interview, but with yourself so that all the districts could see it and then we got to just very patiently wait to hear back of whether or not we got that position. I was a work-study student throughout my whole time at, in college. Um, it was only a small amount and usually it was paid, paycheck to paycheck, but with the paid internship, it helped immensely. I was able to do more with my money, save up. I could uh, actually get more groceries. First semester when we were only here three days a week, I did have a second job and it was very time consuming. Um, I was constantly going back and forth between work. There'd be days where I left here right at four and I had to be at my next job by five. And we hoped that that dinner was gonna be in between. <laughs> um, but then the second semester I was here five days a week, I didn't have to worry about that with the paid position and it took off so much weight off my shoulders. And I was able to really just dive into the class and like learn everything around me instead of worrying about what was I gonna do like here and when I got home. Traditionally, a student teaching is one semester, so you're only there for a short period of time, and that is it. Um, however, for the year-long residency, you get to know your mentor teacher, you get to know your students really well, and you're in the classroom every day, pretty much. The first semester, you're there three days out of the week, and then the second semester, you're there every day. I loved having um, my student teacher here for the whole year. I felt like it was a great bonding experience for us, but also for the students. It was very beneficial. Um, I also think that it was uh, beneficial for her because I felt like she was able to see the year from beginning to end. We get to really have a good idea of what um, those expectations are for students throughout the entirety of the year. And I just really enjoyed it. And I got to know the students and get to know who they are and what I can do to best help them in all these situations and all the classrooms. We get to, to kind of train them up and then really see them in that first year teaching and walk alongside them and get to really um, help them in that first year. Um, in the year-long residency you can build a lot more community than 
one single semester because you get to know the teachers around the school. You get to see them, you get to interact with them. They want to know who you are and want to keep you because they get to see you grow. She's not afraid to ask questions. She's not afraid to um, be wrong. Um, but she also has great ideas as well. You know, being fresh out of college, I've learned a lot from her. Um, so I definitely think it's just a partnership. She's been a wonderful student. Um, the initiative that she has um, was great. She always had great ideas and brought those ideas to me. Um, she was excited about what she was doing. The candidates that come out of this program are quality, first-rate candidates. They are eager to learn. Um, they're happy to be here. For year-long residency was the first time I've been in a Hunts school, Huntsville school. So I didn't really know much about Huntsville ISD. I wasn't sure. For the longest time, I thought I was going to go home to teach. The fact that it's a year-long residency is really an opportunity to really build strong relationships. I really enjoy the environment and like the community at the school. Honestly, there's times where I'm sitting there and I'm like, I am the teacher. Like this is my class now. I don't have to like check about every little thing. Like we can just do it. It's really exciting. I actually talked to myself walking down this hallway this morning. I was like you are the teacher. Like, you've graduated, you're done. Like, this is, this is real world now. It's awesome.